I am the great Throdini. I'm here to introduce the great Throdini signature series TGT knife in collaboration with the Western Stage Props and Circus Stage Props. It's an exact duplicate of what I throw on stage, the TGT thrower, in size, weight, and shape. I've used these knives to set and break perhaps some 40 world records for speed, distance, and accuracy. For example, cutting the ashes off a cigarette in someone's mouth, throwing three knives within a second, throwing 144 knives around the target girl in a minute, and throwing the knife 101 feet into a 12-inch bullseye. It's a great knife that can be used for recreational throwing, competition throwing, and by all means as I do professional knife throwing on stage. Now I'll show you how to use it. My style of throwing is called the peel and throw method. I just keep the knives in my left hand, points away from me. I'm standing facing the target. I don't even look at the knives. I just peel one off, I take it back, and I throw it. Same thing, I take it back, throw it. It doesn't matter whether you like to stand with your opposite foot forward, same foot forward as you throw with. It doesn't matter what's ever comfortable for you. It really doesn't matter. I prefer standing. I prefer standing with my weight on both feet with the opposite foot forward. Again, the knives are in my left hand, pointed away. Peel and throw. For a blade throw, which would be a half spin, one and a half, two and a half, as far out as you can go, you always grab the knife by the pointy end. So it would be like this. I simply feel for the knife to be right there, hand down. There's my grip, just like that. I rest my thumb on the side of the knife and I wrap my fingers around the knife. If it's a handle throw for one, two, or three spin, I simply take it off the bottom of the stack, hold it the same way, about like that, right in the hand, in the palm, and then wrap my fingers around it. Now I'll demonstrate the release. After I bring the knife back, I extend my arm forward, out, and down. It's as though I'm trying to point to the bottom of the board from back here. So the motion is something like this. Even though I don't stick my finger out, it's as though I'm throwing my arm and my hand down to the bottom of the board, like that. And from there, I just come back and grab the next knife. So after I grab the knife, I bring it back, put it behind me with my elbow up. I often, when I'm throwing just to create the rhythm, is to actually touch the knife to the back of my shoulder like this. And then release. So it comes back, tap, release. It doesn't always do that, but it sets a rhythm if I want to do something very specific. The release is right here when the knife is pointed directly at the sky. Right up at the ceiling, it's as though your hand slides off the knife. You don't open your hand, you don't flick your hand, all you do is have a soft grip on the knife, and as it comes around, Right in this position here, your hand slides off, and the knife continues to turn. demonstrate throwing the knife for a half spin, a full spin, and a one and a half spin. That would be from the blade, the handle, and the blade. So this is a half spin from the blade. Now would be a full spin from the handle. One and a half spin from the blade.
I'm Kyle Peterson with Western Stage Props and Circus Stage Props. Thanks so much for watching our video. We hope you enjoy the knives.